Hey! Hey, we're back. Welcome back. So, today we would thought we thought we would talk about <clears throat> being in a relationship while you're in your eating disorder. Is it possible? Hmm. <laughs> well, have you ever thought about um, the relationship that you're in or the relationships that you've been in in the past with your eating disorder um, being so present and how they've affected them? Yeah, I mean, a lot of people think, you know, I can balance, you know, two things at once, but really your main relationship while you're in your eating disorder is your eating disorder and to keep it alive and strong. Therefore, you know, trying to be in a romantic relationship, even a friendship, a sibling relationship really is put by the wayside and is secondary to really the eating disorder. Mm -hmm. And the person that you're in that relationship with, it kind of... It definitely hinders the relationship between you and that person because, you know, you're putting a responsibility on them to, um, you know, have to maintain this eating disorder with you when, you know, in most cases, the significant other or the other person in the relationship doesn't want to see you suffering. So by continuing to engage in your eating disorder and staying in this relationship and staying in a relationship is really only going to hinder the growth of that relationship and, um, you know, can ultimately end it or make it become a more traumatizing experience than anything. Yeah. So, you know, I think it's really important to think about, you know, your priorities, um, you know, it really takes, um, a significant amount of effort to work on someone's recovery and, you know, prioritizing it and making sure that who you're surrounding your, yourself with is helpful and positive and supportive. Mm -hmm. um, but really, you know, it is sort of a, um, a detriment to yourself and the other person um, by trying to stay in that relationship while you're uh, full in a full lorn eating disorder. Mm -hmm. So really challenge you to think, um, you know, what your priority is and like how you want to kind of work on improving your yourself and your relationships. Yeah, really thinking about if that relationship is, you know, recovery focused or is it more, you know, engaged in the eating disorder as well. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.